Hey everybody, we're back with some more multiplayer, not multiplayer, what day is today? Ah, multiplayer! I think today's live play Saturdays, and uh, we've got a Konami game, as you guys can see. Konami. Rocket Knight Adventures. Oh dear god, for look at the this little, what is he again? He's a possum. Look at this little armored little possum with the sword. One of the... One of the mascot platformers of the early 90s. 1993 was a heck of a year for video games, I'll tell you yes, what. Yes, because I came into existence. Yep. And you did too. And, and so why. did I. <laughs> yeah. Oh, every time I try to play this game, the controller setup is different. Because playing on an emulator, because it's so much easier to record on an emulator than <laughs> it is trying to get a Sega Genesis and record on that. But, yes, Rocket Knight Adventures. We are... Uh, Trey, you've never played this game, right? I've never played it, but I've seen you play through it before. Yes, because, once again, not the first time we've done this. Recording troubles and whatnot. But, uh... Now let's see if you can have a flawless run. You know what's funny? Uh -huh. I think I'm on hard mode. You're... Oh, dear God, Chris, why? Why would you... Not would my, you do something Not like my this? doing. It just automatically puts you in a hard mode. Well, you see that uh, where it says rest in the top corner? Yep. Um, and it says times one. Usually it says times three. Oh, dear God. Luckily, I'm good at this game by now. <laughs> yeah. Several times. Recording. I've kind of done it a time or two. Once for but, uh, purposes. That does actually make me really nervous because later on this game gets a little dickish. I keep forgetting that that's there. I'm going to collect as many one-ups as I can. So, on those things right there, you don't stop. It just keeps going, doesn't it? On what things? On the uh, the branches, or are you just holding holding over when you're when you're on it? Uh, it's it's very heavily momentum-based. Okay, yeah. Um, so, if you've got momentum going on, then you'll end up... Uh, you'll end up doing a lot of things. Anyways, there's a trick to beating this guy. Get behind him. Don't let him hit you. <laughs> um, yes, I hope to beat him. You don't let him hit you. Do the uh, like the bullet cartridges, cartridges. Blah, 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 blah. Those hit you. Oh, slip and slide. No. Whenever they hit you, do do they hurt you? No, they don't. Oh, okay. See, the trick to beating a lot of the bosses is just to get them into a uh, into a pattern. Yeah. So that you, like, will never get hit. Rocket now, Knight now Adventure. I don't see how you're hitting him whenever he's up at the top, though. Uh, just like a backswing type deal. Okay. The problem this game with this game has is that when it has so much stuff going on, you can get a lot of slowdown. Yeah. And that's a problem that a lot of, like, particularly 16-bit um, games, like uh, SNES and Genesis games, have... Yep. Like, that's some of the worst slowdown I've seen in games. Now, the only ones that I've seen so far was just because I I don't really play these kind mm -hmm. of games that much, and the only ones I've seen you play were just this, and Mega Man X was the ones that I've seen the slow, like, really bad slowdown. Ooh! In. You do a lot of damage, sir. <laughs> Hello! Kind of sucks that you can't turn around, though. Well, actually, you, yeah. don't really, you don't really need to. Well, I'm doing my darndest at the moment. I, I haven't played this game in a hot minute, so uh, here's hoping that I don't just, like, completely fail. Yeah. I'm, like, really nervous about this, because I don't want the playthrough to look like crap. No! <laughs> if you go into water, is it just automatic, just over? No, um, it just drags you a little bit. Gotcha. Um, which I did not want the collision detection to just take me into... <laughs> Take me collision detection. Oh, collision. <laughs> Look yep. at that. Because that wall just had it coming. Oh, no one messes with I'm, the armored I'm, armadillo. That's what I'm going to call him. I'll be honest. Like The start of this game is not incredibly hard as far as platformers are concerned. Yep. <laughs> it's just like, nope. It's just stupid at times, <laughs> but... Like... When I think hard platformers, I think likes of, like, Castlevania. 
and and stuff oh, like that. And no. this is definitely <laughs> not on that level of difficulty. Though it it could catch you off guard if you're not prepared. Auto scroll. Yeah, auto scrolling levels suck. Just gonna Actually, back really before, okay. Back before was the uh, I think was isn't it the first time that it showed you that you can actually bounce off the walls doing that? Yes, um, that's a that's an interesting mechanic that is like not really terribly well explained, mm -hmm. but like this is really the the part of the game that um, <coughs> excuse me, uh, where if you don't know how to do that. Progression's just not gonna happen. Yeah. And especially since I'm doing this on hard mode, which I shouldn't have done. <laughs> Gotta get all these one ups. Yeah, because you're gonna need them. Ma well, maybe. Oh, look at the present. I'm, I'm hoping that this is gonna be like some of my previous playthroughs where I didn't really need, like, I didn't do any serious dying for a long time. But life's not fair, is it? No. Yeah. No. Never is. Always starts off the same way, this boss fight. Attack his head while he's down. Oh. And then the bugs! Jump over him. For the love of God, this is actually where I usually take the most damage. Ooh. I actually think that's the first time I've done that without taking damage. <laughs> nice. Oh. Now, how do you prevent yourself from getting hit by that? Duck. Well, that. I really Luckily, don't want it doesn't attack you in the one only open spot that you can be in. Or it might. I really don't want this to... I don't want to lose here. Like that. Ugh. Dun, dun. I'm doing ho I'm doing, like, really bad considering. Actually, considering my f first playthrough. Yeah. <laughs> if this doesn't work, I'm going to... Um, nah, I'm not going to say that. No, Chris. It's going to work. We're going luckily, to get this Luckily, you get this thing. That any one ups respawn. Oh, so, so you can just die and just get another one, pretty much. Pretty much. Ah, nice. As long as there's a one up between your checkpoint and the place you died at. Yep. Which may or may not happen. It just kind of depends. This guy's just dancing around in the background. Look at him. It's the foreshadowing. <laughs> yeah. Wonder I think in. Uh, I know in uh, easy mode you can kind of like abuse hitboxes and get multiple hits. I don't know if you can do that in this one. Yeah. Um, which is interesting because I actually haven't played this on hard mode yet, so I don't know what the differences are entirely. But it's like just uh, from. From a, a moment's glance, it seems like the the collision detection is a little bit different yeah. in that uh, it kind of it, it makes you do a little bit more. Nice. That's how that's supposed to be done instead of my, you know, glorious screw-ups at Being the beginning. Being a failure. I'm yeah, sorry. I'm I'm okay with that. I wouldn't have got that far, so I can't really say much. Traded with a game game over it on the first first inning. first <laughs> on the trucks <laughs> on the trucks yeah it's like it comes like what do I do what do I do what do I do oh god I don't know what to do that king is really annoying but yeah. that the sound effect <laughs> that was made it, I'm just gonna inch to oh, no, uh, just jump on flappity flappity as they were walking he was like don't jump off don't 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 you don't no, you no. Do it. Oh, he did it. That's a mighty long ship you got there, buddy. Overcompensating. Pretty much. Look at all these jacked up trucks. Do, 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 do. Boss? 
like many games on the Genesis, I really like this, um, the sound direction that they went in for this game. Yep. Not having it. Apparently. Trick is to use the charge mechanic and not miss like I just did. And, uh, not just kind it. of attack him. Uh... How many you, uh, he, he's just like a small, like, small mid, mid, mid boss, boss right? yeah. How this is really where, a lot. This is really where they start, uh, okay, I'm not dying to a mid boss, thank you. I guess I am. <laughs> the mid boss is like, yeah, you are. <laughs> the best thing to do is just duck into the water until that's finished, um, charging and you see an opening. The good thing is that the charge is, even if you're falling, kind of has um, a lot of invincibility frames. Um, and that's something that you, you kind of abuse later on. The... There's very <laughs> satisfying explosions in this game. Makes you feel accomplished. Yeah. Like, I really did something. <laughs> he blew it up. <laughs> yeah. I like how in like game game games like this, everything explodes when you kill when you kill it. Oh yeah. Everything. And that's that's great. He thought. And he was wrong. As always. Slippy slippy slip slip. Like, even if it's just a living thing, it's explode. Yep. See, this this portion right here is kind of a little bit uh, disorienting because you've got a background stage and a foreground stage. Yeah, and a mid-boss that operates using both. On, yes. Huh. Do you have to hit the uh You have to hit the tail. The yeah, I thought so. I figured. Oh man, this is this is gonna be painful, isn't it? This was this was a boss that I always get annoyed by. Because like he's just really hard to hit and there's no definitive pattern yeah. like there's set paths but there's no rhyme or reason to the path and so all you can do is just hit him until that happens Pretty luckily I him. beat him I have lost to that guy before. <laughs> Numerous. He has yeah. killed before. And he's not afraid to kill again. These spike balls, you can kill them. So, don't be... Don't feel threatened. They're not as bad as... Uh, Gordo's in, say, uh, Kirby. <laughs> oh, that was close. Invincibility frames, mate. Wouldn't have done a thing. Except for that. That it's did shiny. something. Just keep going. Breathe through the pain. Just keep swimming. Just keep swimming. Very dangerous underwater section. What do you think about underwater sections in underwater games, Trey? Underwater levels, Chris. Underwater levels. Asked and answered. Why are they real? I think it... It just depends on how the level is constructed. Oh, this is gonna be fun. Like, like, <laughs> like something like that. Anybody like automatic rail bad. sections? Or oh, Donkey yeah. Kong Country? Definitely in Mega Man. Actually, is that automatic? This? No, the uh, one in Mega Man X. Oh, um, the Armored Armadillo stage? Yeah. Yeah. 
But uh, your feet aren't strapped to it like in this one. Oh, okay. See, in this one, you can actually jump and stuff. And stuff. Wait, no, you can't. You, you can, can jump. Never mind. What am I talking about? You can jump, but like you're always going to be but, like, you're always gonna right, right over right the the okay. thing. Yeah. Okay. Didn't expect him to come out from right there. Pretty much. Very careful mounting and dismounting. Those this this part right here always makes my palms sweat because you got some really precise jumps to make. Yeah. Duck. And then you have to go straight into ducking. And then into the easiest part of the stage. <laughs> There's, no There's always a... Story. Like, one thing I noticed with platformers like this, you get these patterns, these very exploitable patterns. And, like, that's the only way you can really win is by exploiting the pattern. Yeah. Oh, oh Cuckoos. dear God. No! Get away from me. And this one's just going to follow you. This one's just like, I like you. I like <laughs> I you like. a lot. It's literally just going to follow you. Why, why won't it do okay, so the, it help you? Okay, so asked and answered. The collision detection is not different. I just need to not be a, be a pleb. Oh, the, the chicken's gone. If you get close enough, you can actually score what is essentially two hits mm -hmm. by a swing and then the projectile that comes after. Oh, okay, yeah. And that's really the best way to deal with a lot of bosses in this game is just by scoring, you know, multiple hits. Okay, so how are you supposed to defend against this thing? Uh, the same oh, way you defend yeah. against any rapist, really. <laughs> Do you, do you have to hit his hands? Yes. <laughs> you have to hit the bad touch. Oh, jeez. <laughs> My hands are swinging. just dangling. Just dangling. That's an awesome pair of danglers you got there, buddy. Ah. <laughs> uh. I really don't want to keep dying at the same at all the bosses, yeah. but uh, it's really looking like this is a recurring this... theme. Do what? It's looking like this is a recurring theme. Oh yeah. I would have been very sad if I missed that jump. <laughs> this fell straight down. Slow down's good for something. You can't hit me. I have the slowdown on my side, don't you know? Barely. Good, 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 yes, good. It's like you're beating up a guy in a wheelchair right now. This is what you're doing. <laughs> Much more elegant, <laughs> I'd say, but... I've never actually tried doing this by dashing into the hands. Uh, so this is a new kind of strategy for me. Um, I'm usually just used to... But it seems to work because you got a lot of invincibility frames, like I said before. Ooh, yeah. nice. And it was a lot quicker, too. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> if it ain't broke, don't fix it. Yeah. Duck, 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 duck. Dodge. Oh, now he's throwing out bombs. Hey. It's okay. I do my best not to get hit by these. Didn't get hit by them. Nice. Got hit by him. You know what game... Like, this, these explosions remind me a lot of Metal Slug. You ever play that? Metal Slug? Yeah. I do not kind know. of a side-scrolling platform shooter. Kind of like Contra, except for with more explosions. <laughs> I have not played it, no. I've played Contra, though. So I kind of know what you're talking about. Right. <laughs> 